Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? I hope you are all having a great week so far. Today I just kind of wanted to, um, I guess just hang out with you guys. It's a Monday, Mondays are, you know, the restart of the week. I sort of like Mondays just because I can get a little bit more organized again and yeah it's the third week of school it's been going great so far does anyone else feel like it's just going by really quickly and you just got hit with a ton of bricks because my high schooler she's a freshman we have already gone to countless meetings took her to get physicals she's going to join soccer this year so she's excited about that and yeah it's just a bunch of money 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 here and there they already have a field trip coming up and they already have a fundraiser going on so yeah i did not think high school would be like this but here we are um so yeah today um i'm just cleaning well trying to clean up the house a bit i'm not gonna do the full cleaning because it is rainy and I don't want to sweep and mop today because it's just gonna get all messy anyway so yeah um I also need to water my plants usually I do it for Wednesdays but I didn't do it last Wednesday so I'm gonna do it today so yeah let me go ahead and do that Okay, so I also wanted to share this really cute Etsy shop that I found. It's called Glitter Party and Co. And um, they have all sorts of cute finds for parties, all seasons, all holidays. Um, I wanted to get something cute for my daughter's back to school pictures and um, I decided to purchase this felt banner it is so adorable she has probably like four different back to school designs this one was just my favorite um, I just thought it would go well with the girls theme um, I liked all the cute little different colors and look at these adorable pencils you guys oh my god I'm so in love I had it hanging on my dining room wall for their pictures and after the first week I just moved it here to our fireplace and now it's time to um, put it away so that's why I have it here and now for this beautiful honeycomb pencil it is another item that I purchased from her Etsy shop she had the pencils a pink apple and a red apple and of course I had to get this guy. It is really big. This is my hand next to it. And it is adorable. It's a fun little prop for my girls to use for their pictures. I believe the pencil was $12 and the garland was $30. Um, she has different sizes of garlands and different options. So yeah, I'll have her information in the description box. And now it's time to put these things away.
things on Facebook Marketplace, um, or I guess it would be, you know, our neighborhood Facebook page. One of the residents in our neighborhood posted um, these amazing bamboo chairs, and it was a set of four. I'll go ahead and show you guys. Um, and this carpet is actually um, part of my finds too, but I'll go ahead and share this first. Um, so yes, it was a set of four and a table. I didn't really need the table. I mostly wanted it for the chairs, but it was a great deal. I could not resist. Um, it was only $30 for the table and chairs. I was actually interested in that first, but someone had already um, commented on Facebook so i commented for another little side table that he had and once we went to pick that up he um just said hey first come first serve if you're interested in the table and chairs go ahead and take it he was really kind um and of course we saw it and i fell in love and i just had to get it so i ended up putting this chair and this chair on the edge um I gave them a cleaning, um, but most likely I'll probably um, recover these chairs. And um, I used the other two for our outside patio and the table for now, just because I don't have any space for it here. So yeah, I am really excited with that find. So it was the four tables and the, I mean, sorry, the, the four chairs and the table for $30. And then the other little side table, which I'll show you now, was $30 as well. Okay, so this is the little side table. Um, it's also made of bamboo. It's so beautiful. His mother-in-law actually passed away, which is pretty sad. And um, they were going to get rid of all her things and sell the house. You know, I'm happy to um, go ahead and give these items a new life. Um, we are definitely going to enjoy them and we've been enjoying them and um, I also grabbed this beautiful umbrella stand um, I don't know if you guys if you guys follow me on Instagram I already posted it there um, just needed a good scrubbing and cleaning and it's just so beautiful um, and this was actually um, separate he sold it for $20 which I think it's a steal um, I looked them up uh, they're definitely no less than $100. They can go up to like $300, $400. So I think that's such a great steal. And then for this beauty, um, it was a free find again from our neighborhood page. Um, it is a really big guy. It is, I believe they said 13 by nine if I'm not mistaken that almost takes up all of our <laughs> dining room space um, and yeah it was just you know for free I had a, a little bit of um, some spottings they had kids I understand hey it was free I was just like I'll take it um, I wasn't really sold on the color just because I would I would have wanted a more neutral color here in the dining room but it is perfect. I know on camera it looks a little darker blue, but it's actually like an aquamarine blue. Yeah, you're not gonna be able to see it right. It's definitely showing off more um, darker on the camera, um, but it's just beautiful. It opens up all this space. It just looks incredible. And we are covering our old um, ugly carpet that was built into the floors and it's a quick and easy fix for something that we just don't have time to do right now it was definitely a great great score and then I also changed our dining room light finally after we're about to be here for four years you guys and um, I finally found the one I really liked. It's in between a more modern approach, traditional. I decided on this beauty. It's from Amazon and it has these beautiful shades. It's a gold color. 
and um, it's for the LED lights. It's just so gorgeous, so eye-catching. It definitely changes the whole vibe from this area. And it was only $125 which again, great deal, great steal. Let me go ahead and turn on the lights. There you go. I really love the traditional style it's giving here. In the future, I do want to paint our dining room and possibly add like moldings on the walls, um, but we'll see when we do that. I don't know exactly yet. I like to take my time and <laughs> make big decisions. Oh, you guys also um, I don't think I ever shared my tea kettle that I just got I got it as part of my anniversary present and they were having the barn sale during July and I was able to finally jump the gun and purchase it I'm so so excited um, I've always wanted a Mackenzie Childs teapot it is just so perfect and everything I ever thought it would be. I purchased the three quart size and it's really, really big, you guys. I was really surprised. It's bigger than my head. Um, and it's just absolutely gorgeous. The detailing, the painting, the different colors that it has. It has like these greenish, bluish, orangey um, colors to it just kind of something special that i can have in the kitchen to um look pretty and be useful as well and you know it's something that will last forever and i can definitely pass it down to my daughters if they ever do want it but yeah it's just so so gorgeous and it looks so pretty here in our stove All right, so we just came from Dollar Tree and um, they had a few things, well, most most of Halloween out, but I saw a couple of videos on Instagram, so I'm thinking they didn't have a lot of it out um, just because I didn't see some of those items, but I did find some, which I'm really excited about these finds. So um, first I grabbed this um, silicone mold and I just thought it was really cute for only, you know, $1.25. Um, you know, you could use it for chocolate or um, just even making ice or just candy or cupcakes, whatever it is that you need it for. Um, and from what I saw, they only had this version, but I'm pretty sure they just didn't have the rest of them out. So, yeah, I got that. And I picked up these cute little festive um, cups for the girls. They also have like a black iridescent one. I thought this one was the cutest one or the one that will go more with our decor. The eyes are a little creepy, so they're kind of like creepy cute, but um, I was just thinking of tying some ribbons, some ribbons around here to make it a little more um, our style. So I picked up two of those. And then from their $5 line, this, I picked up two of these garlands and let me see if I could take one out so I was able to take one out of the bag um, I thought this was really really cute for only five dollars they are black little bats it does throw a lot of glitter as you can see um, so be aware of that uh, but yeah it's a pretty big garland let me see if it says the size and it says it's six and a half feet long so um i thought these would be great for you know our mantle or pretty much anywhere you would want to display put it around a wreath as well they had bats they had um spiders and then they had um like a 
fall leaf, gar leaf garland. If you guys are interested, definitely go. These were the last two they had, so I just had to pick them up. And then the last thing I got from Dollar Tree was this really beautiful scrunchie. I love daisies. I love anything flower related. So um, I saw this and I was like, wow, this is really, really adorable for um, my girls to use or even myself. Now that I'm thinking about it, this would have been cute if I would have just kind of gifted it to them like that. But yeah, super cute finds at Dollar Tree. And then I also picked these bat clips up. They are, um, they look almost the same as the ones on the garland. And they have these little clips. And I thought that would be great for um, putting them on the, on a wreath. You don't necessarily have to buy a Halloween wreath. You can just kind of make it yourself. And yeah, so I got one pack of that. And then during the weekend, I also um, went to Ross and I picked up these little cute lollies for the girls. Thought they were really, really cute. There's a little Frankie. Oh, there you go. And then an eyeball and then a cute little bat here. They are Tutti Fruity flavor. I just picked them up just because I thought they were just adorable. And I think they'll look cute in their, like, their little um, baskets or on display. And then I also found these candlesticks. They are really, really big and beautiful and thick. They are ribbed. And usually for a pack of these, it will probably be more on the $15 side. So I was pleasantly surprised um, finding these for only $6.99 and it's this really beautiful pinkish color. And then lastly, I found this cutie right here. It's this beautiful mushroom candle. It smells really, really good. It is a harvest fig scented candle from Sterling Farms. It was a little pricier than I wanted to pay for. It was $14.99, but um, I think for this cute little vase itself, it's um, worth it. And as a plus, it does come with a candle inside. Um, it reminds me of like an anthropology dupe. Also, um, Urban Outfitter dupe. So I thought this was a great find. They also had different colors. And yeah, I was really excited to find this little cutie at my Ross. And then I really quickly wanted to show you guys what I found in Walmart. Now, everything I'm showing you is a collective haul. I didn't just go one day and buy all this. Um, I just usually go throughout the week and pop in and out of the stores. Um, so my Walmart didn't have all Halloween out, but they did have a few things out. And what I saw, I absolutely love. They always have the cutest things for the best prices. So I that's definitely one of my staples, staple stores. Um, for you know any seasonal decor so first I got this beautiful hocus pocus sign it is like a wooden um, cardboard sign it was only 444 and it has this clip here in the back so you can hang it on the wall or you know a door or anything like that it's beautiful black and white and I love these little stars it looks so whimsical um, you know, this would be perfect for a little tear tray or a coffee bar. And then secondly, I found this beauty right here. It is just so gorgeous. It's pretty big and it has these beautiful pastel color um, letters and these adorable bats. This one was $7.98 and again, it has this little clip in the back. These are just so adorable. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep both of these. I originally wanted to go find this sign. They didn't have it out, so I purchased this one. And then the other day that I went, they had this one out already. So I had to get that one as well. And I guess I'll just take out my Halloween stuff and see which one um, will go with my decor more. And then I picked up these um, Halloween gel clings. My daughters always love getting these. Um, for every holiday, they love decorating their mirrors and their rooms. 
So I picked up this cute little skelly. He's so adorable with little jelly stars. And then my other daughter wanted this little cute cat with a pumpkin and the bats in the moon. So cute. And they were only $1.78. They also had bigger packs. And then lastly, I picked up these two Mylar balloons. I love decorating with balloons. Usually I pick them up like at Dollar Tree or Walmart. And I saw these. These are so cute. They're, these are definitely new. I didn't see them last year. And yeah, they have a little straw on the back to just blow. Um, so you could just blow them up and just display in your home. So yeah, definitely check out your Walmart. They always have the cutest things there and I can't wait till they take out their real pumpkins. I usually get a few of those as well and spread them out throughout the house. Alrighty friends, well thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you would like to. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!